pay when he's competent. So there's something about a nine. Yeah. So you can hear Metal Reaper from the other room. He's like, I like, knew it! I knew it! I knew it! Oh. Stango's probably trying to explain his stuff. Like, see, the thing is, the, one, the reason why nine came out, like, he's always trying to do that, you know? Like, like RNG, you took three, two and a half steps forward. You, yeah. you moved about 254 pixels. So uh, right yeah. in that position. And uh, and you, as Marth, uh, dashed back and manipulated the RNG. So you got a nine. Yes. I demand a, a recount. A recount. A, a redo. A Bernie's a, votes. A mulligan. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Because that was some cheese. That was some cheese. So can they replace a mic busted from Rohit's screen? He said Kappa. There's no mics that got busted from my screen. My, yeah. I held the mic closed like this. I don't, I, yeah, I'm not too yeah. sure what you're talking about. Winner's finals. Winner's finals. Here at Salt 42, you have two of your top three teams for tonight. The money for an eight-team bracket will be top two. That means that the winners here have guaranteed themselves Ooh. a little... The court. Better money, red team off to a stock lead. Against the court. First of all, the corp goes blue? The corp is blue. The corp. Oh, Jimmy, can I borrow your controller? Oh, uh, never mind. I do have mine, but I heard legendary stories of yours. Yeah, so I want to try it. The corp gives up the red color. You know what? Yo, they gave up the color. They gave him a freak Stango stock. Like, I think, what, what is this? I think that they were Collusion. I think that the Game & Watch hammers wasn't for striking. <gasps> I think it was for color. Oh my god, it was. Oh my god, that re-grab. That was godlike. Do you see it that? Was, it was Yo, Marth up tilt, Mare? reverse back air. It was oh, reverse, reverse back, back air, back air into, Fox, into Stango's... Hands. Ooh. Ooh, the hands. Scooped him up. Handles, scoops. yo. Scoops. Jimmy, what do you have to say about that scoop? Said, where's the ball going? Amazing scoop. Send it my way. I've got the shot. J Ooh. Shout out to James Shot. Shout out to Shot. That guy nodded at me. I'm not back at All him. All right, yeah, yeah. Uh, James Shot, T.O. of the Hop Shop Local. Yeah. Little yo, by the way, I have to go do something days. 840 divided by two real quick. Alright, got this young solo casting on deck, red team taking the lead that they got in the first few opening moments of the game and holding on to it up six stocks to four against the corporation, corporation incorporated, ooh up air, but if we can find a peach kill, up tilt with great DI from Brook, up is the wrong direction, we have an even game in stock count. Blue team with a cumulative 100%, 120%, rising as we go. Uh, red team trying to hold on to their lead. Both players very good of the red team at holding on to their stocks, not getting gimped. And blue team is brought it back. Uh, they need something big here. To, uh, Ooh, shines. Let's get back into it. Ooh, Griffith missing his angle. Red team still barely holding on to their lead. Reverse Nair, not going to be able to kill. Oh boy, here it comes. Able to uh, kill Metal Reaper. But Stango, or no, not Stango, Griffith hogging the ledge from Brook. Quick edge guard from Stango, and suddenly Blue Team finds himself up one stock. All right, Brook with a grab in center stage, not able to do much with it. Comes down with forward air. Blue Team, despite a very shaky start, somehow brought it back. F smash on Brook. Oh, Stango gets out there. That's a dead space animal. Up three to one. But uh, it's done. Oh, oh, okay. But Brook, uh, no, a legendary, a legendary oh. double set a while ago won the one v one against Stango. Let it not uh, be forgotten. Back air, uh oh, down throw. Okay, oh, yeah, just, just wait for it. Definitely game. over. All right. Yeah. Oh, yep. All right, F smash. All right. All right. So. This is your first best of five that you will see tonight. Winners, losers, and grand finals here at the lab in Hatboro will always be 
always and forever be best of five. Uh, we are currently sitting in game two of winner's finals for tonight's doubles bracket. Metal Reaper and Brooke picking this stage in a no ban situation. Uh, feeling that this is their strongest counter pick. I, personally, have always thought that the Corporation's weakest stage is FD. Because the lack of platforms. Marth, a little bit of trouble getting down. Fox can get chain grab. Also has a little bit of trouble getting down. But mostly, uh, there are no platforms to help the Corporation combo, who are fairly proficient at team comboing, especially when they can have positions as, such as the platforms. Down throw, up smash, the pew fat. Weird down air, hits his teammate. I believe the singles bracket will be beginning. Uh, however, doubles will continue to go on this stream. You can find the singles bracket at smash.gg slash salt42 uh, and click on the singles bracket link. Uh, I honestly could not tell you how many entrants we have tonight. It is at least 30, maybe upwards of 40, 50. Uh, I have not been in the front room recently. So, blue team finds themselves up seven stocks to six. Make that five. Up throw up air? All right. Good DI from Brooke. Getting herself out of that situation. Smokey not holding down for that down smash. Only getting hit by one hit of it. Oh, no. Metal Reaper trying to mash out some button. Ends up getting a drill instead off stage. Possibly a down smash. Not too sure what happened. Slides right off and loses his third stock, aka second to last, very prematurely, not passing 30%, I believe. Uh, so that really puts the red team in a super, super bad position. That hurt a lot. No team combo with because of Stango's godlike mash out. Still up 6-2-3. Make it 5-2. to two. Uh, Metal Reaper wisely taking the stock. No reason not to. Ooh, the shines. Not here who's being called for singles right now. Uh, Brooke at 90% still can make this stock really work for her considering we are on Dreamland. A huge, huge stage. Smokey. Wow! So Smokey had a mashed out Nair that almost ended his second to last stock. And then... Alright, gets caught up on the platform. Uh, lawn Chair. Sorry. Old habits. Stango comes up with an F smash knowing that Griffith will tech it. Goes for the team kill, but knows it won't kill. And he techs it and he is good to go. So the corporation find themselves up two games to nil. Going into game three, corporation this week might try to keep a little streak going of trying to not drop games in doubles uh last week or maybe it was the week before when i teamed yours truly with control alt defeat uh the dream was rip definitely took a sweet game on battlefield hopefully and it was this same team composition uh fox peach we will see a breath of life from team brook and metal reaper They've already secured themselves a spot in uh, top three. Loser here goes down to loser's finals to face uh, anyone else coming from the loser's bracket. Whoops. We will see who that will be. My prediction is Dimension Fuji Bean, which means it will not be a run back. Dimension and Fuji were knocked into losers by the corporation. No others. All right. Still have not been called for singles. Uh... And red team up oh, five stocks to six, but game one, uh, blue team was in a very similar situation and they ended up bringing it back. But that's a dead fox on battlefield. Five stocks to four, still holding on to a single stock lead. Griffith trying to keep Metal Reaper in the corner. Not the best DI on that back air, but somehow makes it back with a straight angle back throw. All right, not looking for any gimps on. Uh, Smokey, a.k.a. Griffith, the White Hawk. Really high up B from Stango, recognizing that uh, Metal Reaper was going for a double jump refresh instead of an up B or a shine up B. Hits him right out of it. Ooh. Metal Reaper definitely hoping for a normal hitting Nair instead of reverse Nair. And we've got a four stocks to three and a Fox at very high percent for both members. This might be the game that Red Team needs. Alright, 
Last stock for each member of blue team. No jump? That's a dead Stango. Metal Reaper running through. Coming out of the woodworks to shine Stango. Ending his last stock at a measly 33%. That was huge. But uh, Peach at a drill, wave shine, up smash percent. Up throw, up air. It's all there. Meaning that Griffith has a very fair chance to nail this 2v1. Oh, shine out of shield. That's it for Brook. Two stocks left. Metal Reaper does not ask for the 1v1. Does not want to risk the shine spike. I respect it. Oh, back air down smash into stage spike. Down smash will always hit to the opposite. Will always hit to the opposite side that the uh, character is on. Leading to a swift stage spike. 2-1 Corporation. Opting for their counter pick to be Pokemon Stadium for game four. Don't think I've been called for singles yet. Uh, blue team, you know, they were much like uh, a set when I play with control alt defeat. Uh, just got gimped a, one too many times and lost a few too many stocks a little bit too quickly there in a 2 0 deficit. Oh, Metal Reaper gets there. Full hopping over all the pressure and getting there to the ledge to steal it from one Nicholas Stango. Sorry, Nick. I know you hate being called that. Uh, look, now team combo. Good DI from Metal Reaper. DIing off of the platform, but not away into Griffith's up smash. Alright, Stango calls up Miss Tech. Calls out the wake up shield. It was a quick little pivot F smash, I believe, but. Griffith overextending a little bit with his edge guard, trying to get Metal Reaper out of the out of the picture, and instead meets a back air from Brooks. Well placed Peach, positioned right in the air. Oh my gosh, gets a grab. Uh, that was Griffith. An even stock situation, six to six. Both red team members at a fairly high percent, but the same can be said for blue team. Text the up smash. Wow, Griffith somehow finds a sliding brook just, just shooting by and up smashes her my god she was gone oh man she just gained all this speed going sideways and all Smokey had to do Al Griffith had to do was redirected upwards and suddenly we have a five stocks to three and Stango looking to get Metal Reaper somehow gets his hands on his teammate but making the stock work for him at 122%. Peach with not a lot of recovery options right now. And Stango just falls right off the side. So we got four stocks to two. A high percent Peach. Up throw. Oh, no up air. Not quite able to get there in time. But there it is. And all right. Uh, so that was a quick kill. Recognizing Brook on the platform. Not ready to move. Gets up aired. And then... Stango, I looked over and suddenly Metal Reaper's off stage. It might have been F Smash, might have been an F Tilt. Who knows what it could have been? Just drops off, and I believe he just weak fares him. Huge hitbox. No way he's going to miss it. Doesn't need to go for a down air. He can miss. He can sour spot. It's whatever. He's got the stock lead. And just like that, ladies and gentlemen, probably only gentlemen, uh, we have.